Let's review this particular problem in which what we have is this conjugated ketone, which is undergoing reaction with trimethyl salvonium chloride in presence of NaOH as a base. And I have made an exclusive video on sulfur elite. Click onto the title to know more in which I have covered everything you need to know about sulfur elite chemistry in deep detail. So let's get back to the problem in this case. What the NMH does, it abstracts this particular proton which leads to the formation of this dimethyl sulfonium methylide which is an unstabilized elide. We have two types of elides, stabilized and unstabilized. And the one of the properties of this unstabilized elide is if we have a conjugated ketone, they only attack the ketone as a result of which what they form is an epoxide. Had it been a stabilized elide, it would have attacked this double bond and it would have resulted in the formation of cyclopropane. But in this case, the correct option is option number one.